long hole, which was the 10th. So Yuka Sasso, the US Open champion, rolling in a sweep. That for an opening birdie. And this is my sleeper pick coming into today. Gabby Lopez had the lead at one stage last year. Starts off well. Lucy Lee, this was her tee shot at the fourth, just 19 years old. What a day she enjoyed yesterday. 64 from the teenager. Oh! Nearly been that as well, but an easy two for Lucy and to love over the years to come. So Nana Madsen at the second. Poured that one in as well. What a start from Nana Madsen. 24 under par. Thought it couldn't start any better like she did yesterday, going birdie birdie. She's gone eagle birdie to start today and a bit of body English here on the third, but catches the right edge of the fair. I think we're going to see a lot of low scores. Boutet from the middle of the fairway, 152 yards. Not making it easy. Well, that's got to go. It's got to settle now. Gives you a fair idea of why this is playing the heart. Well, the lady she pipped to the post 12 months ago. Ataya Titi couldn't. Best place tie coming into Sunday. Oh, that gets a roar. Pacey at the end. Wasn't far off going in. That was great touch from the Dane. It's very good effort from there with that picking up pace off the slope. And that's really what you want to see when you're off to that hot start, as Tom mentioned. You know, if you're not going to make a birdie, stress free pass. You don't want to put that putter under pressure. The key for Nana Madsen as well, and, and I know Dom. Now, oh, brilliant two from Chi Yu Lin at the fourth, she said. Alison Lee, playing from the other side of the hole. This for a birdie at the sixth. Okay, oh. Alison Lee rolls another one in, gets back. Gained come into play, and that's where you can measure a player's performance by how well they compete against the average on tour. It's got to go, come over the corner of the bunker. Oh, it's got to sit down a little bit. It's okay. Not her best, but... Brooks found a pair of them already. This for another. Slight downhill putt on the sixth. Wiggling right. Wiggling Brooke Henderson into a share of second with Chi Yu Lin. <laughs> she just took it. Oh, and this one is this one's in the trees, right? Now that bunker on the left side has seems to attract a lot of balls over the week, and this is headed that way. Should be all right. It's just cutting back to the fairway. Jennifer Cupcho from the back of seven. This is her third. Nice to pop this one in for an eagle. Oh, she very nearly did. Carried at least six yards onto the putting surface. Trying to do what Titikun did. They got that big old roar from the crowd assembled round this par five green and uh, tugs that left. Three yards today. As I mentioned, that hole in the front portion, very accessible. Likes the look of it. Uh, just coming up short, but that's going to leave her an uphill right to left putt.
Oh, those are the shots too that you just, you really feel the nerve. That's the direction the bad weather comes from. She Ooh. missed a couple. What do we have here on 11? Slide left, drop in. Atia Titikun. They're getting louder this Sunday. Okay, Sugoi. Now to the hard charging Titikun on 12. Starting the day seven behind the lead, Atia Titikun now finds herself only three back. She is eight under for the round today. This now for par. Great effort. Just never, never in position on that hole. What? She would do well to get it to the hole. Outside chance to join the lead. Impressive. Great bounce back from Madsen after the front page of a leaderboard. Sure will. Pops that one in. Yeah, she's got a couple of great. Second here for Brooke Henderson down the hill. Narrow entrance to this green. Everything runs past uh, middle toward the back edge. Took driver off the deck a couple of days ago. It's not a bad line either. Oh, when it rains, it pours. It's a three shot lead again. Now for Nana Mads. Left side of the 10th. Nice uphill lie. Let's pop it on, let it release out. Something just like that. Gabby Lopez. Okay. It was a sluggish start. Korea, there's plenty of those. And a star at this venue for many years, Amy Yang. Something about this place just resonates with. Cool. This player's a winner. She won the US Open. And that is a 62 for Yuka Sasso. What a scorecard. 32. Move in to a share of fourth alongside Celine Boutier. Well yes, done. very nice. Fourth birdie of the day. It's from Madsen. Amy Yank just through the green on the 13th. Up and over the hill, into the cup. Amy Yang. Count them up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven birdies. from a perfect spot. This is getting even better. What a shot from... Oh, this has got to get down. Oh, goodness me, unforced error there from... Very nicely played from Nana Madsen. Oh, this is right at it. It is right at it. It's a bold attempt from Shi Yu Lin. This is not a bad line either. Ooh. Oh, this is so good. Oh. For, for me, that's the the big showing as uh, Celine Boutier taps that in for a two and draws what Madsen. Make that 14, should this go in? Madsen at 12 to extend her lead at the top. What a good putt. It's an easy three. Her pace putting's actually dark. Up above. Oh. 
How about that for a two? Well played, Shi Yulin. Only two shots are different. Conditions. Fire at pins, 130 yards. Looks really good. The flag. Safe on the... That's a first drop through since the sixth hole on Friday. Should this go in? This one's down the right center. Trying to decide what to do, so shoot in. Over 158 yards sharp. Oh, and it's left and short. That dead ground you were talking about, Tim, can be deceiving, but tug that a little bit as well. So Shi Yulin hoping. And she might be using that slope. Keep your eyes peeled on this. It's going to ride the ridge down. There's going to be a tap in. How much difference playing this year? So much softer on the grades. Gabby Lopez, just short of the green at 15. So. And it is very makeable. I think this is the tournament here if this goes in. Final putt, hopefully, for Daniel Kang. Yep, well played. Well, it was a hole in one on the eight. It's heading left. It's finished left. Don't think that. Enjoyed that. I think that was the first time you saw her really, you know, get into a moment. That's a nice little tap in there for a, a hot cue. Well, it's a good three, and the Chinese player. Oh, well, that one certainly did. A brave effort for Shi Yu Lin. Should happily take a two putt from here. It's always going to be a tough assignment from where that tee shot ended up. So a three putt bogey. The first three putt of the day for Mads. White with the 48 incher. Oh, yeah. It is a good one. What's she going to do with it? Do you think she'll keep it? Could she auction it off? <laughs> Will she throw it to the crowds at the end of the day? She won't dislike this. No. Oh. This looks good too. Two shots in close, make that three. How good were they? They're getting closer and closer and closer. Three starting shots, there's a reason why. It will be a four for Madsen, and so a glimmer of hope now affords Shi Yulin a very makeable birdie opportunity at 17.
Oh, and she's got it. She's got it. Going to have to hit two solid ones in these wet conditions to get it up to the green in two. Well, there's a good start. And she's tugged it left, but it should be okay. It knocked on wood. And we heard what we thought was a, who would have caddied for Amy Yang when she won. They were a team a few years ago, so he has a huge amount of experience around this track. Oh, that's the right club. A terrific shot in from Shi Yu Lin. An eagle opportunity. Oh, this is miles right. We told you there'd be drama. Goodness me, that's in the hospitality suites. Has to land it short of the green. Take the sting out of it there. But not that much. Yeah, you could just see it happening, though. You brought it up. Green to work with for the French player. Needs to get this close. Not just close, but in. And what a time to... Anyway. This for an eagle. Putter from off the green. Oh, it's got to slow down. Oh, it's got to slow down. And the head continues to spin for Nada Madsen. In it goes. What a birdie on the final hole from Shi Yu Lin. She... And she has smashed this right up the middle. Straight up the middle. What's that Churchill quote? Never, never, ever give up. <laughs> it's got to go a bit. <sighs> <sighs> Nothing jumps up from there. Oh, this is left, but it might catch. No. me how did that miss oh talk about a pit shot under pressure so very nearly the grandstand finish for Shi Yu Lin but she will be first into the hole for a four and if that doesn't go in for Nana Madsen goodness I stepped up quickly to it buried it in the middle yeah, absolutely. I don't see her missing this fairway. And she hasn't, although she's out to the right. May have a longer second. 16 for... Well, this is kind of where the first drive was on the 72nd hole in the left rough maybe it's higher but it's left Oh, 
this looks pretty good. It's more than good. It's brilliant. Oh, that was exquisite. And for the third time playing the 18th hole, Nana Madsen has this putt to win the Honda LPGA Thailand. In it goes. The Dane delivers.